Let's create a matrix which has three rows and two columns. Yes, three rows and two columns. Matrices are named using capital letters. We can call this one matrix A. Now there are a few super basic things we need to know about every matrix. Just three things. First, what are the elements in the matrix? Second, what is the order of the matrix? And third, what is the position of an element in the matrix? Just three things. Elements, order and position of every element. Let's zoom out and understand each of them in detail. Elements are nothing but the components of the matrix. This matrix A has six elements. 3, 1, minus 2, 4, minus 1 and 6. That's all. Six elements in this matrix. And the elements of a matrix don't have to be numbers. They could also be letters or random characters. So the elements arranged in rows and columns make up a matrix. What is the order of a matrix then? This matrix A, as we can clearly see, has three rows. And it has two columns. Three rows and two columns. The order of this matrix is 3 by 2. Yes, this is the order of this matrix. Don't forget the number of rows first and then the number of columns. Next, we come to the position of an element. Every element in a matrix has a unique position. But how do we define the position of an element? It's easy. We look at the row in which it is placed and then the column. Yes, row comma column. So in this matrix A, what will be the 1 1 -th element? What does 1 comma 1 mean in this context? First row and first column. This is the first row and this is the first column. 3 is the 1 1 -th element. So what is the 1 2 -th element in this matrix? First row and the second column. It will be 1. This goes on and the last element would be the 3 2 -th element. Third row and the second column. It will be 6. The row number comes first and then the column number. And the same applies to the order of the matrix. Number of rows by the number of columns. Writing the order as 2 by 3 will be incorrect. The number of rows will always come before the number of columns. So let's try understanding these concepts with an example. The matrix given to us is 1, 5, minus 2. We have been asked to find its order, the 1, 3 th element and the 2, 1 th element. Pause the video and try to answer these three simple questions. Okay, let's zoom out and try answering the first question. Look at the matrix. It has one row and three columns. One row and three columns. The order of the matrix will be 1 by 3. Now for the second question. They have asked us for the 1 3 -th element. This position implies that the element is in the first row and the third column. Now look at the matrix. First row and the third column. It's minus 2. Minus 2 is the 1 3 -th element of this matrix. And what about the 2 1 -th element? Second row and the first column? But this matrix has just one row. So the 2 1 -th element does not exist. Let's quickly review what we learned. What is the order of a matrix? If it has m rows and n columns, the order will be m by n and not the other way around. And how is the position of an element of a matrix defined? The row number first and then the column number.